This is our community. This is my community. Uh, my wife and my girls, we all live here. We've, we've been here for over 10 years. We're rooted in it. Polson Police Chief George Simpson is working to change the narrative around his police department after two disturbing incidents have rocked the small, tight-knit Polson community. Perfectly understandable that, you know, people would have some, some trust issues with that. Uh, I can tell you that public trust is the probably the most important thing to us that we have, right? We cannot be a successful organization or a police department for our community if we don't have that trust. Simpson took over the role of police chief in April after former chief Wade Nash was arrested for DUI. Two weeks ago, Polson police officer Matthew Tim was arrested on account of sexual abuse of children. After allegations were brought forward regarding Tim, Simpson said his department immediately brought evidence forward to outside agencies to remain objective. Got in touch with Lake County Sheriff's Office to have them start to investigate. And once we realized there was some validity to the allegations, uh, I called DCI and turned it over to the state and they kind of took the criminal aspect of that investigation from there. Simpson says the police department promises to remain active in the community with open public safety forums planned in the coming months as they work to rebuild the public's trust. I encourage and expect them to hold us accountable and, and to let us know. And that's, that's really what it's about for, for everyone here, myself and my family included. Like we want to see Polson become a better place to live, work, learn, and play. And that, that's the goal. In Polson, Sean Wells, MTN News.